In this video, we are going to solve exercise 1c and this exercise is based on problem sums. The first question is, a survey shows that the population of Arunachal Pradesh, Meghalaya and Tripura are 13,82,611, 29,65,000 and 36,71,032 respectively. What is the total population of these three states? So the statement will write like this. Population of Arunachal Pradesh is equal to 13,82,611. Population of Meghalaya, 29,64,007. Population of Tripura, 36,71,032. Therefore, total population of three states. So how to find the population of three states? We'll simply add the three numbers. So adding the three numbers, our answer is 80,17,650. You can also add it in a columnar form. Next question number four. A number exceeds 47,56,908 by 16,34,096. Find the other number. Now, in the question it has said, a number exceeds. Which number? The number which we are asked to find. Exceeds. Exceeds means more than. So, the number which we will find is more than 47,56,908. That means this is, our the, this is the smaller number. By how much is it small? 16,34,096. That means this is our difference. So, we'll write the statement as the smaller number is equal to 47,56,908. The difference of the two numbers is 16,34,096. Therefore, the other number. Now, I have already said that the other number is more than 47,56,908. That means we will have to add the two numbers to get the answer. So, by adding the two given numbers, our answer is 63,91,004. Next question number 7. What number must be subtracted from 23,56,714 to get 8,69,873? Now the question has said that a number must be subtracted from 23,56,714. We, we know that the number which is subtracted is smaller. That means the number which we have to find is the smaller number and this is the greater number. And the difference is already mentioned in the question as 8,69,873. So let's start with the statement. The greater number is 23,56,714. Difference, their difference is 8,69,873. Therefore, the number to be subtracted is or the smaller number so how to find the smaller number? We'll subtract the number because if we add the number, it will be more than 23,56,714, which should not be the case. So what we'll do is we will subtract the numbers and the, therefore we get the answer as 14,86,841. Question number 10. A man had rupees 1 crore 35 lakh with him. He gave rupees 56, 56,32,560 to his wife, rupees 37,84,890 to his son, and the balance to his daughter. How much money does the daughter get? So let's start with the statement. Total money the man had is 1 crore 35 lakh. The money he gave to his wife, rupees 56,32,560. Lakh the money he gave to his son, rupees 37,84,890. So first let us find out that how much is the total amount he has given to his wife and son. So how to find the total amount given by him to his wife and son? We'll simply add the number. So by adding 56,32,560 and 37,84,890, the total amount given by the man is 94 lakh. 17,450. Now it is said in the question that the balance is given, given to his daughter. So the total amount was 1 crore 35 lakh out of which this is given to his wife and son. So how to find the remaining amount? That is we will subtract. 
so from 1 crore 35 lakh subtract 94 lakh 17450 so the answer is rupees 40 lakh 82,550 which he will give to his daughter. Next question number 12. The cost of a chair is rupees 1586 that is 1586. How much will such 245 chairs cost? Now in this type of question when in the when it is mentioned that the cost of uh, one item or article is mentioned and you have to find the cost of more number of articles we will simply find the product of the numbers given in the question in simple words will multiply so we'll write the statement as cost of the chair is equal to rupees 1586 therefore cost of 245 chairs is equal to 1586 into 245 here i have done the calculation hence the answer is 8 sorry 388570 question number 14 an aeroplane covers 1685 km per hour how much distance will it cover in 58 hours so again similar sort of question here in 1 hour the distance is mentioned you have to find the distance covered by the aeroplane in 58 hours so we'll write it as distance covered by aeroplane in an hour that is 1685 kilometer therefore distance covered by aeroplane in 58 hours equals to 1685 into 58 by multiplying we'll get the answer as 97730 kilometer next question number 17 if the cost of 65 refrigerator is rupees 48,46,400, what is the cost of each refrigerator? Now, this question is just the opposite of what we have done earlier. Here, the cost of more number of refrigerator is given. We have to find the cost of one refrigerator. So, in such cases, we will divide it. So, the statement goes this way. Cost of 65 refrigerators is equal to rupees 48,46,400. Therefore, cost of each refrigerator is equal to 48,46,400 divided by 65. So, 65 sevens are 455. Remainder 29 will bring the 6 down. Again, 65 fours are 260. Remainder 36 will bring the 4 down. 65 fives are 325, remainder 39 will bring the 0, 65 six are 390, hence there is no remainder left and one more 0 was left in the dividend which is brought over in the question. So the answer is rupees 74,750. Question number 20, a car covers 4320 kilometer in 45 hours. At what speed per hour does the car move? Now, again, similar type question which we have done just now. Distance covered in 45 hours is 4320 km. We have to find the distance covered in 1 hour. That is 4320 divided by 45. So, 45 nines are 405, remainder 27. Again, we'll bring 0 down since 4, 27 is not divisible by 45. So, 45, 6 are 270. Therefore, no remainder is left. Hence, we can see that the car can cover 96 km in 1 hour. But in the question, it is mentioned that we have to write the speed of the car. So, speed of the car is the uh, formula for speed is distance divided by time. So distance covered in 1 hour is 96. So and uh, so we can write the speed as 96 km per hour. That means in every 1 hour the car is covering 96 km. Next question number 22. A man covers 36 km in 1 hour. Find the speed in meters per second. So the speed of the car is given, uh, sorry, the speed of the man is given as 36 km per hour. We have to convert this kilometer per hour into meter per second. Now, 
how to convert this 36 kilometer into meter so we know that 1 kilometer is equal to 1000 meter therefore 36 kilometer equals to 1000 into 36 and this r is written in the denominator so per r 1 r how to convert 1 r into second we know that 1 r equals to 60 minute and 1 minute equals to 60 second therefore we can write 1 r equals to 60 into 60 second so here we have written this in uh, the required 36 kilometer per hour in this way that is 6, 36 into 1000 now the 36 kilometer is converted into meter and per hour per hour means divided by 1 hour so divide by instead of writing 1 i have directly written converted this 1 hour into seconds that is 60 into 60 now if, we, if i cancel 0 and 0 then 6 6 uh, 36 so the answer we get is 10 meter per second there are some questions given as your homework we can have a quick revision of this question number one by how much is 15 lakh 69 thousand 748 smaller than 20 lakh that means we have to find the difference amount difference in this two amount question number two what must be added to 46,97,859 to get 63 lakh? So, how much should be added to this to get this as the answer? Again, we have to find the difference amount. Question number 3. A factory produces 9675 screws in a day. How many screws will it produce in an ordinary year? So, one day it is producing 9675 screws in a year. How many days are there? 365 days. So in 365 days, how many amount of screw is it going to produce? So we have to find the product. That is, we have to multiply. Question number four. The product of two number is 17,20,714. If one of the number is given 1,785, find the other number. So we will divide the two numbers to find the other number. Question number 5. 13 kg 650 gram of milk is distributed equally among 21 students. How much milk will each get? So in 21 student is getting 13 kg 650, milk, 650 gram of milk. So how much will each student or one student get? So we will divide to find the answer. Hope you have understood this exercise properly. Thank you.